Uh, hey guys, uh, this is Joel. Um, last video I did, I did a uh, cracking video and one of the cars that I had was a 59 Cadillac Eldorado with this trading card. Um, as a picture of the car, uh, as a picture of a car, not a picture of the car, because this is the car that came out of the package. In any case, uh, the back of the car, it also says what else comes in that line. Um, I save these, and what I do is I purchased a, uh, uh, a book that um, people use to save trading cards. You know, like uh, sports cards, baseball cards, uh, football cards, things of that nature. Uh, I got this idea from uh, another YouTuber in Canada. Um, he hasn't been online in a while. Um, I think it's Picker Nation, um, uh, man in Canada. Um, <clears throat> anyway, um, I went and got this book. It comes with the pocket um, things, and I'm just going to put this in, and I'm going to show you what I have. Okay. Um, a lot of this stuff. Um, See if I can adjust this. A lot of this stuff may not necessarily be worth anything. I don't care. I just thought it was kind of cool to keep it. Okay? So, um, and it's not in any particular order or date or anything of that nature. So, um, I'm just going to flip through the book. And anything in particular, I'll point out. Um, so... Anyway, so here's uh, Muscle Machines. Uh, I haven't gotten to this video yet, but I do have some NASCAR uh, Pro Racing. Uh, Shot Wheels, so this is uh, uh, those trading card stickers that um, make fun of uh, products. And the other stuff here, these are Johnny Lightning. Okay. Here's the back of them. If they had anything on the back, I show it. Here's the trading cards that come with the Hot Wheels Pro Racing. If it was a blank, I kept it. Some of these have, I think these are the uh, dates of the race for that particular year. Okay. Again, not in any particular order, just the order that I opened the stuff up. Okay, I have a lot of pro racing, so. I really don't know if this stuff is worth anything. I'm not really concerned. I just thought it'd be kind of nice to save this as, um, okay. But the muscle machines, they always had a trading card, which I thought was cool. And I kept, with some of the muscle machines, the other piece that told me what the... Uh, um, the number of the piece was, and the type of car. So I just put that in here as a uh, as a reference. Okay, so that's the only reason. Other than that, you know, <clears throat> that's why I'm saving those. Okay, now this Dub City one I will put in uh, at the first open spot. Okay, like I said, I don't save this stuff in order. Okay. machines here's the cartoons because there was actual book okay here's some of the uh, like tokens and stuff that came out of Johnny Lightning I kept those I put those in here okay this is Johnny Lightning from my uh, 66 Chevelle I'm sorry that's a 67 Chevelle uh, I have some Johnny Lightning Hearst products uh, this is uh, probably for the Oldsmobile one. I'll have to find that. Show you all. Okay. Uh, this is Matchbox for the state of Georgia. That deserves its own uh, spot. 
that was for a van superfly okay put this in here i think there's its own spot and here's the first open and this is where i will put the dub city I'll put that right in there there was some stuff for scooby-doo um, from the Acceleracers, I have an Acceleracers um, Nomad, and this came with the Acceleracers. It's not a trading card, but a little comic. Put that in here so it wouldn't get lost. Cut out on the uh, cop rods. Um, I saved those. I think it's all the same 3D cutout, but um, I thought it was kind of cool, so I just put it in here. Um, that's from an action Superman car. Some of these came with Johnny Lightning. Some of them came with, uh, like I said, the muscle machines. Um, Johnny Lightning came with other stuff like those, you know, collector coins and this stamp type stuff. And if it had like a 3D cutout picture, I kept it like this one here. Um, that's probably from Matchbox. Okay. So no reason to uh, throw that stuff out. Um, this right here is the um, came with my Mattel um, Hot Wheels Club membership. So I got my uh, uh, I guess that's my uh, membership card, and I think there's a uh, a patch behind there. So I haven't opened it up. I just stuck it in here for safekeeping. Okay, and uh, this right here was a stand that came with one of the cards. I thought it was kind of neat. Um, doesn't really represent anything, but I put it in here for safekeeping. And uh, that's the back of it. Barrett Jackson was a card or something that came with it, so don't know if I'll ever use it again. And I still got plenty of room here. Okay, um, one of the cars that I did have in my collection um, came with this bigger style um, model of the uh, uh, AMC uh, AMX, and uh, it's too wide to fit in here. It, it came so you could collapse it, uh, and I didn't want to fold it over to fit, okay, and crease it up because right here there's no crease okay i just didn't want to bend it up that way so i kind of like just put that in the back here to keep it flat but i got plenty of room here okay so um you know again this is part of my hobby and uh, i keep my stuff uh, it's up to you if you want to keep it in order but this is what i'm doing with it so uh, any questions let me know take care you have a good day